This is one of my favourite paintings, an icon painted by the Russian artist Andrei Rublev in around 1400. It's called The Hospitality of Abraham, after the time when three angels visited Abraham and Sarah's home and were showed hospitality. The poem is by Rowan Williams, and its conceit is the moment that God inspires Rublev to paint it. Beech mast refers to the nuts and the seeds of the beech from which flour could be made. One day, God walked in, pale from the grey step, slit-eyed against the wind and stopped, said, colour me, breathe your blood into my mouth. I said, here is the blood of all our people. These are their bruises, blue and purple, gold, brown and pale green wash of death. These, God, are the chromatic pains of flesh. I said, I trust I make you blush. Oh, I shall stain you with the scars of birth forever. I shall root you in the wood under the sun shall bake you bread of beech mast, never let you forth to the white desert, to the starving sand. But we shall sit and speak around one table, share one food, one earth. The altered perspective here is literal, as in many icons. Rather than a vanishing point, all lines converging on a point on the horizon, here the perspective is towards the viewer. We are the focus of the painting, of its characters. We are included. The altered perspective of the poem gives the artist response to God's request for a work by answering that the colours will represent the pain of the world and that God will be etched into the wood forever. Like Job, God held to account. But at the same moment as the end of the poem, to know that it's okay, because the hospitality of Abraham is a sign of the hospitality of God always as warm as the colours, the glances, the welcome at the table.